Hey folks, I'm Todd Tremonti, lifelong Texan, real estate agent, broker, uh, owner of several real estate businesses. I grew up in Houston and went to college in Waco and I've lived in the Dallas Fort Worth area for 15 plus years. So I've got a pretty good feel for the great state of Texas, big cities, mid-sized cities, never really lived in a small town, but have a lot of experience. And the question today is if I were to ever leave Texas, which I probably won't, but if I were to ever leave Texas, where would I go? The answer might surprise you, might surprise the camera guy too. If I were to leave Texas, there's only one place I would be excited to go, and that would be the great state of Maine. I visited Maine and had absolutely some of the best times of my life. And I think Maine today represents a lot of what Texas probably used to be within the United States. A big state with some gorgeous, diverse terrain and, and recreational opportunities with some coastline and some wildlife and outdoor recreational opportunities. The difference with Maine, clearly you have a significant difference of seasonality with some significant harsh winters. You've got, you know, you, you have coastline in both places, but in Maine, you've got, you know, massive, you know, it's not the Gulf of Mexico. <laughs> you got, you got big ocean access with the Atlantic. Um, and just, you know, again, sort of a leave us alone, doing our thing, communal yet, plenty of opportunity to be in a cabin in the woods for a long time, independence kind of thing. And so I love that about Maine. I do also happen to really, really love lobster. Now, again, I, I think Texas still retains a lot of that personality, but as those cities have grown and grown and grown, we've lost some of that unique. Like I, I, if you heard me, you probably wouldn't think I'm from Texas. I grew up in a big, you know, one of the largest cities in the world in Houston, Texas. And I lived an hour north of downtown and, and still was in the city limit within city of Houston. So all that to say, I love Texas. I probably wouldn't go, but if I did, it would be somewhere that retained some of the spirit of Texas, but maybe offered me a little bit more diversity and of opportunity of recreational opportunity that I like, but also that has some of what Texas really used to be. Now, Texas still has a lot of that, but again, it, it's losing some of that in these massive metropolitan areas where the city just goes and goes and goes and goes and goes. Uh, you know, it, it could take more than an hour to cross multiple cities in Texas now. Um, other things I love about Maine is just there's there's a tremendous diversity of cities, right? You get into, you fly in or travel to Portland, Maine, and you get some of that big city feel um, nowhere near the size of Dallas or Houston, but still a big city feel. And you can make it all the way up to Banger or Bar Harbor in Maine and experience small fishing village feel, which Texas has a little bit of if you were to kind of go near the Beaumont area or um, some areas of the coast, you know, coastal island areas, not so much Galveston, but down towards Padre and some things like that. But um, again, love Texas, probably I'm not going anywhere, but love the idea of coastal Maine and then inland Maine, you know, there's some incredible uh, kind of farming region with some fruit trees and fruit production that I'm personally into. And again, this video is simply about where I might go if I were to ever leave Texas. Now, of course, I'm a small business person, entrepreneurial type person. So when I think about a place I go, I'm certainly looking for a place that might have some opportunity as well. And I could dream of having some vacation cabin type businesses up in the main area, maybe some guided sailing and fishing and things like that. And then I would love to take advantage of some of the growing regions in Maine, a little further inland where there's some, some wine country. There's a little bit of a booming um, brewery, kind of micro brew uh, <coughs> community in Maine. And again, Maine's a really big geographic area. There's a lot of land there. So there's great hunting, fishing, as well as as you get further south towards major markets like Massachusetts or New York, Boston, New York City, you've got, you know, huge employment hubs and a lot of things going on. You got exciting things that are more well known like Kennebunkport and things like that. And then some really itty, itty bitty village communities, lake cabins, coastal cabin type stuff. So, you know, short, fun video here. But if I were to ever leave the great state of Texas, the only place I really get excited about would be Maine. And I'll throw an honorable mention in for Colorado. There's a lot to love about Colorado, but for me, I love to visit Colorado. That's not someplace I would want to live permanently. Part of that is due just to the 
uh, the lack of ease of travel, right? Mountain passes, you got to go around, you can't go direct, things like that. Um, I do really, really enjoy that culture for a vacation, but probably not my long-term home. So uh, nothing negative to say about anybody. Number one pick would probably be main honorable mention for Colorado. And you notice both of those are colder climates because Texas is hot. Love it most of the year, but would like to dodge some of that heat for a more beautiful, cooler climate uh, some of the year. So that's my that's my choice. Let us know in the comments what your choice is. If you could live anywhere, where would you want to be? If you're a Texan, what's the only place that could get you out of Texas? Let us know in the comments. We read them all. By all means, if you're ever making the move to Texas, we'd love to have you. I think it's the best place to live in the whole wide world. And if you're anywhere in Texas and you're looking to buy a home, we'd love to be a resource for you or help you make that purchase here at the Todd Tremonti Home Selling Team. Our information is below. Like the video, subscribe, tell us what's going on in the comments. We'll engage with you there. I'll check with you on the next one. Take care.